Well, a South Carolina elementary school teacher is out of a job this week after a student pulled out two packs of marijuana edibles in her class reward box. It's like a reward box that has candy in it for the kids that do something good. Oh, wait a minute. Did you say elementary school? Yes, elementary Uh-oh. school. Rocky Creek Elementary School in Lexington. Sheriffs say that the Stony Patch Kids marijuana edibles were found from a box of candy that she used to reward her students. She took the edibles back from the student and told him to pick something else from the box. That's when he went back and grabbed the second pack. (laughs) Well, she was loaded with them. She was. Luckily, no students ate the candy, uh, but investigators have found that she is guilty of this, and she is on administrative leave. (laughs) Only administrative leave? Yes, yes. Oh, what are they teaching the kids, Mm. and what are they doing to our kids in school? Yeah. Mm. All right. Waffle House. Now, there are a million stories in the Waffle House City. Mm-hmm. Things that go on in the middle of the night. Oh, yeah. Things that go on after, you know, storms Later. and things and everything else is shut down. The only way you can tell things are open back up is if the Waffle House is open. Right. <laughs> All right. Well, this one was open. So a dude went into the Waffle House in Atlanta. And it's not clear if he'd been drinking or not, but it was one in the morning. And a lot of drunk people come into Waffle House. Mm-hmm. So he ordered up some eggs with cheese. Well, they forgot the cheese. So he complained. Then when they finally did bring the eggs to him, they didn't have the cheese. So he complained again. He eventually did get his cheesy eggs. I'm not sure he would have wanted to eat them uh, because you never know by the time you sent them back two or three times what else they have on them besides the cheese. Who knows what they've done. But nevertheless, (laughs) he gobbled them down. And while he was checking to make sure, actually before he gobbled them down, he was checking to make sure they were right and the cheese was on there. Mm-hmm. He noticed people running out of the restaurant. Uh oh, something's happening. <laughs> he looked up. Here comes his waitress. Uh oh. With a gun. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> she pointed the gun directly at him and threatened to shoot. So he said, nah, "She's not gonna shoot me." He told her there's no way she'd shoot him over some eggs. But then she pulled the hammer back Whoa. like she was going to shoot him. Well, he realized at that point, eh, this could be happening. <laughs> I'm out of here. Now, she didn't fire any shots and nobody got hurt, but <laughs> aggravated assault charges, among yeah. other things, are now coming for that Waffle House waitress. Ooh, what a wild night. Well, you know, people, they are having trouble trying to hire people, so there's no telling what they yeah. will hire just to get somebody to serve <laughs> up some cheesy eggs. <laughs>